Okay, now let's recreate the uh, main event, the co-main event for UFC 276, which is coming on tonight. Wow, he's been in for a while. Seven years? I haven't heard him until recently either, for some reason. Pretty much until I started playing this game. That's kind of funny. Looks like Izzy's got a gynecomastia, <laughs> which is wild because he's in phenomenal shape. And I lost to reach and height advantage. Wow. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City. It's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC middleweight championship of the world. It's who really first. Fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 15 wins, 5 losses. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Fighting out of Glendale, Arizona, USA, presenting the challenger, Jared the Killer Gorilla, Kadimir. And now, introducing the champion, Fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 22 wins, one loss. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Presenting the reigning, defending UFC undisputed middleweight champion of the world, Israel, the last dial bender. You have see belt on the line, guys. Protect yourself at all time. Obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now. Go back to your corner. <laughs> He's so funny, man. He's such a nerd. And where in the world are all these 6'4 fighters coming from? Jeez. I remember when Tito Ortiz was big at 6'2. And that's a light heavy. Now we got 6'4 fighters at middleweight. How are you 6'4? 185 pounds. Jeez.
Ooh. And for these uh, UFC 276 fights, I'm going to play as the challenger because their stats are tremendously weak compared to the champ to make it more compelling. Especially since apparently I'm decent at fighting legendary AI. Ooh. Spoke too soon. Boy. I don't have Machida's forward and backwards and sideways movement speed. Ooh. So I gotta be careful. It's harder to dart in and out. Oh boy. Now reach advantage. Okay, good. Don't wanna blow all my cardio though. Seems like cardio is this game's meta. Okay, good, good. Ooh. That reach is so good. Oh, boy. Couldn't drop those hands for me for just a second. I think Cannoneer's got better hands or higher power, punch power rating than Adesanya. But Adesanya's got him on pretty much everything else. Okay, good. I can throw elbows. I can throw knees. Ooh. But do I have flying knees. I only have one knee. No flying knees. No advanced elbows. Let's try some leg kicks. Ooh, boy. Got to be careful during those leg kicks. Don't want to get punched in the face. There we go. Nice little trip. Okay, did that was that a glancing blow? Oh, that was not. Okay, good. Now let's yeah, that's what I wanted. Oh. hit me with those John Jones knee kicks. Jeez. Isn't that funny? People think those should be illegal. In a sport where you're uh, attempting to break people's bones and using blood chokes, a knee stomp is too heinous. It's kind of like the 10 and 12 out or 12 and 6 elbows that cost John Jones is only a uh, DQ loss. There we go. Those front kicks. Working out Machida style. Ooh, there we go. There we go. I don't know if this is how Cannoneer fights, but it's how I fight. There we go. Looks, can I finish this in the first round? Ooh. Okay. Let's do some more leg kicks. Let's do three leg kicks. And then, uh, oh, uppercut. Whoops, range. Oh, no! Oh, that was so stupid of me. At the end of the round, too. Wow. Wow. I was crushing, too. With the high kick. Oh. 
That was incredible. That was incredible. I guess that's why he's the champ. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Leving has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 54 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undisputed USC middleweight champion of the world, Israel. Okay, nice job, champ. That's probably what's going to happen tonight, too, unless something crazy happens. Kanemir's a beast. Went from heavyweight to light heavy to middleweight, but Izzy's too strong, man. Reach is too good.